Zdravo i dobre dojdovte. Hello and welcome to my Macedonia. Macedonia is a country with a rich past, flourishing today and a promising tomorrow. A surprise awaits for you in every corner of my country. So come on and join me on a scenic tour of my country like no other. Honest as a warm summer day, and their lives as chilled as winter evenings. A country where smiles never fade, and beauty never jades. A land of stories, a land of victories. And a land of love. This is Macedonia. Former Yugoslav Republic of Macedonia, or simply Macedonia, is the youngest country in the Balkan region, surrounded by Greece, Albania, Bulgaria, Serbia, and Kosovo. Macedonia is a habitat of almost two million people. Macedonia, the place where I was born, the place where Mother Teresa was born, and so was Alexander the Great. During his rule as the undefeated king of Macedonia, Alexander the Great had created the largest empire from the Ionian Sea to the Himalayas. From ruling the world to ruling the hearts, Macedonia is also the place when Nobel laureate Mother Teresa was born. She was born in the city of Skopje. Her former childhood home has now been converted into a museum of her memories. This iconic place is fairly flocked by tourists visiting Macedonia. A beautiful mix of cultures, old and new architecture, have given Macedonia its distinct personality. Macedonia, a country with its unique identity, rich, deep-rooted culture and a million stories to be told. A synthesis of architectural work as the amalgamation between the past and the present, making it all ready for the future. Statues are a very important part in the structure of this country especially in the capital city of Skopje. The many newly constructed stone and bronze statues restore the faith in the rich Macedonian heritage. Some of the most prominent statues are the statue of Alexander the Great at the famous city square. The other two famous statues are that of Alexander's father, King Philip, and of Saint Cyril and Methodius, who wrote the Macedonian language. These statues are also amongst the many tourist attractions in Macedonia. Turkish architecture is spread across Skopje and other parts of the country that was brought in by the Ottoman and stayed on even after the Turkish reign, which lasted for almost 500 years. The robust 6th century Byzantine fortress near the city square adds on to the cultural diversity of this country. In 
in Macedonia, diverse faiths coexist in perfect harmony. But as Christianity is the major faith practiced, there are plenty of beautiful churches all over the country. Especially St. Naum's Monastery in Ohrid, which looks over the scenic lake of Ohrid. Far from the maddening crowd, these monasteries here exude a sense of calm, silence and peace. Macedonia is perhaps the most unexplored country on the European continent, still away from bustling tourist crowd and crazy jams. The most celebrated aspect of Macedonia is its scenic beauty. And the one place where beauty is in abundance is the Lake Ohrid. Situated at the south of the country, when you enter the city of Ohrid, the first thing that will catch your eye is the lake that straddles the mountainous borders between Macedonia and eastern Albania. Lake Ohrid is one of Europe's deepest and oldest lakes that is spread over 87 kilometers. You can just keep looking at the blue waters of the lake and let your senses free. Be numb and get lost in the tranquility of this huge lake. From the lake, go a little west and you will find the ruins of the ancient Greek city Heraclea in the city of Bitola. Heraclea, which was once the episcopal center of the Byzantines, was savaged by the Goths in the 4th century. And the ruins now are a major tourist attraction. Panoramic landscapes that support this ancient country is the reason why Macedonia attracts almost a million tourists in a year. One of the recent major attractions is the Millennium Cross on Mount Vodno. This was built recently to celebrate 2000 years of Christianity in Macedonia. There's a three and a half kilometer long ropeway that runs over the skyline, offers spectacular views of the city. And carries people to the top of the mountain. And the view from there is to die for. Macedonia also boasts of being one of the few habitats of the rare pointy-eared Eurasian lynx. You can find this cunning creature along with some distinct wildlife in the Skopje Zoo. With so 
much on the platter. Macedonia is a place to be explored and experienced before the rest of the world realizes what they are missing. As a tourist destination, Macedonia is slowly getting popular. And one thing that is adding to this popularity is the emerging trend of adventure sports. Matka Canyon is one of the famous destinations for alpine rock climbing. If you have the heart to climb up the steep mountains, then be assured for some jaw-dropping views of the canyon. But if you are not up to climbing mountains, you may choose to sit back in a canoe or boat and enjoy the splendor of this canyon. Mountain biking is also gaining popularity amongst the extreme sport enthusiasts here. There are some unexplored trails in different parts of the country which offer maximum adventures for the off-road bikers. But if you are an adrenaline junkie, then rush to the hills of Ilindin, jump off the cliff, embrace the air and paraglide. This place also offers you the chance of riding custom-made off-roaders and a drive down the hill in it. But when the winter weaves its magic on the mountains in Macedonia, it converts them into a surreal white fairy tale. Skiing on these edgy slopes becomes a much loved sport in the winters. The ski resorts in the forest of Mavrovo attract people from all over the world. Macedonians love their food. We eat every time we meet. In a country where food is so integral to the culture, you cannot escape the culinary diversity here. Our food is as honest as its people. Regardless of what pace the world moves at in Macedonia, Slow food is the way to go. They say the way to a man's heart is through his stomach. And in Macedonia, everyone will agree to it. Food as to any culture would be, is an inseparable part of this country as well. Food defines the people, their lifestyle and their tastes. There are two distinct kinds of culinary habits that exist in Macedonia. While the gourmet food consists of pizzas, pastas and steaks, it is the local food which is most comforting. From tafche grafche to burek to shapska salad, grilled paprika and meat to nastraza with yogurt, the very mention of these foods will make a Macedonian go weak in his knees and promises to knock you out with its flavors as well. Every Macedonian street food shop has something to entice the foodie in you. There's a saying in Macedonia, 
even the traffic lights don't work on Sundays. Because it's time for families to meet, greet and eat. When families get together, it culminates into a gastronomic festival. Coffee, cheese and wine are three integral parts of their food habit. Macedonia also boasts of some huge wineries which produce the finest wines in the Balkan region. Everywhere you look, you will find something that captures the eye. Everywhere you go, you will find a place that you have never seen before. Any mile you walk, you will find a celebration in my Macedonia. Macedonia is a country of celebration. Festivals need a reason and that reason could be anything good enough for people to get together. Here is full of music and emotion. For every reason, there is a song, and every song becomes a celebration. And these celebrations never stop. Macedonia is timeless. Its eternal beauty and mesmerizing landscapes have impressed everyone who have ever traveled to my country. Macedonia has a little of everything for every kind of traveler. When the country has so much to offer, it sure has something for you to take back home as well. A plethora of handcrafted local trinkets, leather goods, and local produce will take up a good part of your shopping list. From world-class brands to absolutely the finest workmanship in its old bazaars, Macedonia has enough to enthrall any shopping enthusiast. Every nook and corner of the city is humming its own song. Every person is smiling. Every street has its own charm. Every spot is beautiful and blessed by Mother Nature, all in just one panoramic glance of Macedonia. As the sun sets on the mesmerizing Macedonia, the morning sun rises with a promise of a more fun-filled and fulfilling day. A 
country where generations of tomorrow celebrate the culture of yesterday. You will not go away disappointed from Macedonia, I promise you. A trip to here will leave you with the memories of a lifetime.